it, sometimes it's hard. I, I don't think that at least when I first entered my snowboard career that this stuff would ever like exist for me. You know, it didn't seem realistic. I didn't think that I would ever have the opportunity to have an impression over the snowboard community and industry. I had to, like, if I do have that opportunity, I want to do as much good as I can and give back to the snowboard world, not just like myself. My name is Eric Leon. I'm a professional snowboarder. I'm 26 years old and I'm from Riverside, California. Yeah, so I live in Portland, Oregon currently. I've been here for like maybe six or seven years. Uh, I first came to Oregon when I was 14 years old to go snowboarding on Mount Hood. And then I knew when I came to Oregon, I was 14, I was like, I want to do this all the time. So I pretty much dedicate like half of my year living in Oregon, searching for steelhead, snowboarding, and I surf a grit. I like my outdoor space in Oregon that I, it's, it's kind of like my little retreat. I just disappear to kind of clear my head. Maybe I'm just a person that needs like my alone time and I need like my space or something like that, but I just like, I don't know, I like to enjoy like every single moment. I want to like look back on life and be like, I did everything that I wanted to do. Core Snowboarding uses the brands I partner with to help raise awareness for kids that don't have the opportunity to the outdoor world using the snowboard industry to help build the snowboard industry. So my influence over snowboarding and creating and using that and taking that opportunity to make sustainable products, affordable products, and then using the energy and the inertia that I have from the brands to create like and activate nonprofits across the US to raise money for kids that don't have the opportunity to go snowboarding. And therefore like changing kids lives forever, you know? Like and I can personally say that in my life like I grew up in a place where snowboarding wasn't really obtainable. So like having been introduced by people and a community around me like changed my life for the biggest difference like I could ever see like ever happening, you know? Somebody like Forrest Bailey who like who was like, yeah, I was like I like worked with the nonprofit like when I was a kid I snowboarded with like a group of people and look at him like if it wasn't for these people that are contributing back to snowboard communities Like you would never know if we didn't create these opportunities You know, I was fortunate enough to be given the opportunity to go snowboarding and with my influence over the the snowboard industry I, I want to be able to do the same thing for kids that were in my position you know, from five years old to 16 years old, whatever, you know, that's a very impressionable time in your life to kind of change the way you see things. You know, we want to see more diversity. We want to see people from all, you know, all different shades and walks of life coming and being a part of it and help change it with us, you know, help change our perspective. Without that, like our, our sports may never evolve.